Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new guitar lesson. Today I'll be teaching you Golden, featuring Sia, by Travi McCoy. Yeah, really fun song to play along to. Sorry, I fixed a bit of focus there, I think it's right. So, basically I'm going to show you the lead part first, and then we get to the rhythm. So, the lead is pretty, pretty nice. So what that is, basically, it's going to be, basically going to be, yep. <laughs> it's going to be 10th fret on the B string. 12th fret on the high E string. I'm going to play those two together. Five times. So it's going to be five. Sorry. Next part is going to be played three times. It's going to be ninth fret on the G, ninth fret on the B. So we're going to come from this, that shape again. One, two, three, four, five. Straight into the nine and nine. One, two, three. Next shape is going to be ninth fret on the G, seventh fret on the B. It's going to be played five times as well. And the next shape is going to be 14th fret on the G, 14th fret on the high E, which you block the B finger, the, sorry, the B string, which your middle finger. So you just rest it across it so you don't hear it. See? You play that three times. So the very start again, 10th fret on the B, 12th fret on the E, five times. 9 on the G, 9 on the B, four, three times. 9 and 7, 9 on G, 7th on the B, three times, five times, sorry. Then 14th on the G, 14th on the E, three times. So slowly. That is the lead part for um, for a golden. Now show you the rhythm. Uh, the rhythm is just played. You can play it over at any part of the song. It makes no difference. Whatever one you fancy, so it's gonna be. And what that is is basically just A. So it's gonna be the A chord, if you know the A chord. Then it's gonna be C sharp minor. And it's gonna be treats. I'll show you how to play this for us. Just, uh... So it's gonna be down, 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 up. So down, 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 up. And this is gonna be down, down, up on the C sharp minor. If you know the shape, it's gonna be barred across the fourth fret. All across the 4th fret. We're going to bring your ring finger onto the 6th fret on the D string. 6th fret on the B with your pinky. G, sorry. G string. Middle finger, 5th fret on the B string. Wait, yes, yeah, so you got D string, ring. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> pinky finger, 6th fret on the B string. G string, sorry, I'm getting really confused there. And the 5th fret, middle finger, B string. That is C sharp minor. So it's going to be down. For the first chord, A, down, 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 up. And it's going to be down, down, up on the C sharp minor. The next shape is going to be F sharp minor. So it's going to be, if you know the bar chord for this one, it's going to be se second fret, first finger across all the strings. Ring finger is going to come onto the fourth fret on the A string. Pinky finger is going to be on the fourth fret on the D string. And that is the. And it's going to be the same. Uh, same strumming pattern for the A and the C sharp minor as it is for the F sharp minor and the next chord is D, standard D chord. So we'll start again, it's gonna be A, down, 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 up, sorry. <laughs> and the F sharp minor, down, down, up, so down, 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 up, and then the D chord, down, down, up. So slowly. It's a lovely chord progression, very very fun to play. So um, let's run through the whole thing one more time. We're going to start again. If you want to follow along, I'm going to do the lead. So we're going to do it slowly. And there you go, that is the lead and we'll do the rhythm. So again, A chord. The A chord, whoops. <laughs> Start again. And 
And that is it. That is basically Golden featuring Sia by Travi McCoy. Really fun song to play along to. There's not much going on in there, as you can see. There's a bit of lead that's really fun to play. The rhythm is a lot of fun too. Beautiful song overall. Love that one. So, um, hope you enjoyed this lesson, and I'll see you on the next one.